Alrighty then, we are about to be spectating, hopefully, into this next game. Hopefully everything will go swimmingly and we'll be able to start said game very shortly. Oh, yay! Alright! Oh my god, it's an absolute Christmas miracle! Hooray! We're actually in the game. Alrighty! So here we go once again at the very start of another Bronze 5 Theater. Now, once again, I, like I've said every single time I do one of these videos, there's always something new happening in the world of League of Legends. So, uh, so we've got some new content coming out in the form of, uh, like some new skins and stuff, but uh, that's a given. Um, <coughs> Ezreal is getting his, uh, VGU update, or VGU, I should say, uh, finally, which of course means, uh, visual and game update. And, uh, we're invading! The red side, here we go. There's only three of them for this invade, but it's gonna be a 3v3 if Cassidy doesn't respond. Here we go! Fiesta begin! And, oh, that's... Pff, wow, that was a flash. And, yep, alright, well, the blue team loses this one horribly. Okay, and that was a straight-on 3v3 as well, so that's, that's... That's not so good. Not so good for the blue team. But it is good for the red team, which is uh, the guy that I'm spectating uh, through. Is That's where he's on. I'm spectating through the trundle, which uh, I think I spectated that guy before. Also, Rise is just now getting here. Kassadin is literally right behind him, but doesn't see him. That's a little bit sweatstiny. Is he going to flash here? No, he... Oh, now he flashes. Interesting. I think Kassadin might be in range to Q him. No, nope, Jinx is just going to flash. Okay, and now Shen is just going to start the red buff for god knows what reason, even though Kindred is right here. So now it's the red team's turn to die. So Shen is now down. And why do we have an Udyr and a Kindred? Oh, we have support Kindred. Okay, there's something that I'm pretty sure is 100% not a thing. But, uh, you know, maybe they're queued together. Who knows? Alrighty, well, that was interesting. Very interesting early goings here for this Bronze 5 Geta, and that Riven is dead. And she flashed, so that's a free kill for my bro Trundle up there, who took heal and ignite, but I mean, it's working out for him, so... You know, who's to really criticize, am I right? <clears throat> and you know, that's another thing that I've given thought to. Uh, you know, every, every tier, honestly, has its own meta, so like... I guess to an extent, even though I am still, you know, I, I am certain that it is a bad idea, uh, to some extent, it does make sense for people to take, you know, really weird random summoners, like, you know, the Trundle that has Ignite Heal, because it can work. Or, you know, the ADC that takes Teleport, because it can work. You know, it's all because of just the meta, that, that you know, you're, you're matched up with people of equivalent skill level, so... You know, it, it's... It, to some degree, it is something that they would do as well. Also, this might be a double kill for Jinx. It seems very likely. Yes, it is. Why are we watching Trundle? Oh, because that's... That was a 1v1, apparently. I didn't even see Riven in there. Trundle's body was just completely obscuring her. So this is a very, very messy... Me messy match already, unsurprisingly. And, uh... Yeah. Goodyear just stole the red team's red buff. Okay. So, uh, like I said, Ezreal is getting his VGU, and uh, I'm not terribly happy about it. Um, I think gameplay-wise and, <clears throat> and visual-wise, it looks quite good. Also, sorry, I'm like wiping my nose over here. Um, it looks good, but <laughs> my issue is the fact that they, they do not have the voice of Kyle Hebert. Who is, uh, the, he was the voice of, uh, why? Well, yeah, I guess I can say was now. The voice of Ezreal, but he's also the voice of Jarvan the Fourth, as well as Graves in this game. Uh, but more notably, at least for me, uh, he's the the voice of the Funimation English dub's Adult Gohan, which is uh, you know the current uh, English uh, studio that's dubbing uh, Dragon Ball Super. You know they did Dragon Ball Z, they did uh, all the all the Dragon Ball series. Uh, but you know they're currently doing Super, as well as the impending Broly movie, which is going to be pretty hype. At I would imagine. What is Rise doing? Hello? Can we watch this for a second here? Oh, he's... A okay, he was actually started farming there. I... <laughs> he literally had an entire wave of creeps pushed to his tower and he started recalling. Oh. I wanted to scream at him through the internet. 
Oh man, this is... Man, look at the damage on this Jinx. If Shen was actually there, I think they might have actually been able to pick up another double kill. But it looks like Cassidy is going down. And now Shen is going down. And now Miss Fortune, who decided to just sit there, is going down. But she has about a trillion minions here. So let's see just how tanky the Shen actually is. Also, Jinx seems to be hoarding a little bit of the da- Oh, she's taking a lot of the damage. I'm, I'm watching her health bar just tick down very quickly. Um... <coughs> Uh, and also, uh, we got, like, the championship skin for this season, which is going to be Kha'Zix. Still don't know what the Vit Victoria skin is for, uh, you know, anybody that places gold rank or higher in, in ranked. Um, and what was the other thing? It was a pretty big thing. Oh, um, so, the information on the next season's... What in the world? On the next season... Oh, my... Shen, I don't know if I, I agree with this one, but okay, well, I guess it worked. What is this Rice doing? I'm just watching him chase the Shen. Um, so the next season's info is, in fact, here. It is going to be... Uh, well, the, there's two new ranks, uh, anyway, that they, they said were going to be coming out. And the two new ranks is uh, they're going to put a new one in between uh, Master and Challenger uh, called... Oh, God, was it like Legend or something? Uh, I can't even remember the name of it. But, oh, my God, this right. So that... He never recalled. Oh my god, he has barrier! He used it! What? That timing! He's still not gonna recall, is he? No, he's dead. Oh my god, this rise. Ooh. Get very angry with this rise here. Um. And the other rank is actually going to be below bronze. And it's gonna be called iron. So now. Starting next season, the lowest tier of competition is going to be called the Iron Rank. And I... Uh, it, it, immediately, I saw a problem there, because I, I happen to have this sort of series called Bronze 5 Theater. And, uh, oh, not only that, but uh, they're also re reducing the amount of tiers in each rank so that there's only four. So, like, the lowest, the actual lowest new co tier of competition is going to be Iron 4. So, there's not gonna, there's literally not going to be a Bronze 5 starting next season. Are you kidding me? Is she actually going to get away from... Wow! I'm actually tilted that that Kindred got away. I actually thought she was going to do the really silly thing. Oh, Jinx did the silly thing. I thought she was going to do the silly thing and, uh, and just, like, back behind the tower or something. Jinx was trying to come around like she did on the Rise. Oh my god, what in the world is happening? This is an absolute bloodbath. Look at these pings, this guy's pissed. He's dead. Wow, good lord, that was a lot of damage. Did he smite him? I think he smited him. Uh, I, Warwick, I mean, War, I think Warwick smited Udyr. Anyways, so yeah, that's a free blue buff. Uh, Udyr is just gonna continuously ping his blue buff, but nobody really cares, so. Um, so yeah, that's gonna be interesting, so yeah, uh, so, that being said, I'm going to have to, <laughs> I'm gonna have to, if I continue this series into the next year, season, um, I'm gonna have to come up with a new name for it, and I really, I don't wanna call it Iron 4 Theater, I don't know, it just, it, it just has a, I don't know, it just doesn't sound right, so I'll have to come up, maybe I'll come up with a new clever name for it, like, a Super Happy Fun Time Theater, I don't know. <laughs> What is going on here? What is Kindred doing? Kindred just completely zoned out of this match. She didn't care anymore. Wow. And now Kindred died. If, if Jinx would swap Qs. Okay, well. Or, you know, just have everybody just jump on in there. And we're question mark pinging, so everybody's pissed. Is someone flaming on your team? Yes. Who lol? Who, who lol? Udyr? Mm. Oh, I guess that's like, mm-hmm. All right, well. Udyr is a bit of a toxic fellow, according to this ribbon. But uh, hey, you know, this is uh, looking like like a, a solidified victory for my pal Trundle. What is this guy? Wow, he's inting. Okay. Yikes. That's not okay. Um, so this may potentially be a 15-minute surrender, which is, I mean, I guess that's fine. Uh, this is a humongous snowball. I don't actually see the blue team coming back from this unless the red team does some really, really stupid things. And it has to start with Jinx. 
Um, this, this jinx. Um, <laughs> again, <clears throat> you know, I always, I always seem to get that sense, you know, when I, I see somebody playing in bronze, and I'm like, this person does not belong in bronze. Um, and you know, while I don't really want to say that about anybody, you know, I, I, I don't want to just flat out say, this person belongs on the lowest tier of competition. Um, I don't get the sense that j this Jinx is smurfing. Uh, let me look at her CS. Like, I mean, whoa. <laughs> That's a bit of a sweat any moment. Like, I mean, <laughs> you know, I guess it doesn't really matter to an extent. She's not farming creep, she's farming champions. But still... Oh, this is interesting. Does MF have ult? Oh, no, she does not. She's level 5. I thought I thought I saw it up, but I was like, wait a minute, what? Oh, that's bad. Oh, my. Oh, Riven, though. Riven wants to carry this game on her back. Oh, my God. One more auto. Oh, my God. One more skill. One more anything. Like, literally, all she had to do was Q, W, or E there. And that would have been a freaking dead jinx. Oh my, what are they doing? God, they're baiting themselves. Yikes, this is painful to watch. Alright, well, uh, what's his face? He's gonna clean up this kill. And I guess Kindred is also going to die here. Yeah, Shen, Shen's pretty tanky. So this is the second video in a row where uh, we actually have a, a support Shen. Uh, who doesn't seem to be anywhere near as good as the previous support Shen. But, I mean, he's doing well, you know, for his team, he's doing very well. But, uh, again, you know, like I've said, I, I usually get the sense that somebody is smurfing, you know. It's, it's something, something's not right here. Something's just a little bit off with uh, this particular person, is usually what it is. Why is Kindred farming? Oh, I think I see what's going on here. I think the Kindred actually wanted ADC. Yeah, look at the way she's building, too. She's just got Zerk Greaves and uh, friggin... Well, I mean, she's got this support item, but then again, so does MF. So uh, now I'm really confused. Yeah, I guess maybe my first thought was not right. This ooh, WTF is this game, ha ha ha. Oh, okay, they're saying bad words in the uh, in the Udyr chat. I obviously really play Jig... Oh, that's... That's trouble. Oh, oh my. That MF ult was possibly the most unfortunate thing I've ever seen in this series. Yikes. She flashed, didn't she? I think she ulted and then she flashed. Oh my. I, I mean, I, I would assume maybe she meant to do that the other way. I think she meant to flash and then ult. But she appears to have ulted and then flashed and then nothing happened. Yikes. Alrighty then. Cause like all I saw was the AoE for her ult come out and then there was no bullets. This guy's dead. What is he doing? What? What, did he like not see the Shen? I mean, did he tunnel that hard that he just didn't see the Shen right next to him? Just creeping up on him? Oh, hey, Kindred, what in the world are you doing? Holy moly, this Jinx is massive. Although, I don't know, this is the, this first item that she built, good lord, is the new thing that they came up with. I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to rush this. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to rush that. Um, oh my lord, this Cassidy. Cassidy. <laughs> Who? Yeah, this is just... Uh, Oh, okay. Well, I, I wouldn't really say that, Riven, but uh, uh, I was I was gonna say this is really unfortunate. But then again, that's what I usually say about things. Oh, that's that's a Rift Herald. So this top tower is going down almost for certain. Oh my, man! I actually feel bad for the Riven. Uh, she definitely she's putting her heart into this game. She's uh, undoubtedly doing the best on the team, and she definitely wants to carry, but. She's just getting shut down. This The red team just has her at every turn. What in the world? Man. You, just, you, you hate to see it, honestly. Like, you just hate to see... You just hate to watch people just int and just throw the game and say, screw this, I'm done. Yikes. Alrighty then, Kindred. I... I... 
I don't know. I, I don't I don't really find the chat that funny. But uh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe she's talking about the team chat, which of course we cannot see. We can only see the all chat. Oh man, come on, Riven! I believe in you. Oh uh, come on! Don't let don't let Rye steal that. Oh my God, Rise! Ah. Uh, uh, you hate to see it. That's ridiculous. I hate. I. I can't stand it when people do that. Like this guy is. It, well, he was one and seven, and he just assumes that he deserves the kill. Look at he took another one. Uh, I have no faith in this rise. Rise just has not struck me as somebody who's gonna carry this game. Riven certainly has, but rise is. Look at this. Here he is again. He's just. He's just. He's rising, I guess. Why didn't he wait to ult over the wall? Oh, because his ult... Wait, what? I'm confused. Whatever. Anyway. So, yeah. Again, I have, like, no faith in the rise whatsoever. I, I think... I think... I And I would have actually liked to have seen uh, Riven carry this game. I think she certainly has potential to. But, um... She actually needs a team. And she needs the, the Kindred to not... Not do... Not do this. Yeah, have, have the Kindred not... Do not not do this. Don't yeah. Don't do, don't do don't do that. See that that don't do that. Alrighty. All right. I what? Okay, this is a chat, I guess. Anyway, so we missed out on the 15 minute surrender. It doesn't look like it went through at all. I, don't, I guess maybe nobody tried to, and if they did, it didn't show up in the chat. Wait, you're not memeing? <laughs> it's like, that's... Right? Isn't that like the, the mark of like a good... Tr Look at... She's got two levels on the Jinx! Oh my god, no! Ah. Uh, if my boy Trundle wasn't there... Man, I just noticed the score is 7 to 37! Oh my god... You hate to see it. What in the world? Oh my god. Why did she think that it was necessary to flash there? <sighs> I guess flash in so you feed faster. Th I... Mm, my goodness. Uh. Why does he feel bad for Rise and Kindred? Kindred is trolling and Rise is being useless. <laughs> Riven is literally the only person to feel bad for. Also, I'm pretty sure Riven doesn't really know how to use her ult effectively. So, that's definitely something that she'll have to work on there. Yeah, as you see now, she doesn't have her ult here for this potential fight here. Oh, never mind. This is not a fight. This is just a massacre. I'm pretty sure she's dead here. Unless this guy can... Ca oh, no, he can't. I started ganking lanes and then no one paid attention when even when I pinged. Went on a six-game winning streak with Talia Jungle, and it was all down from there. All right. <clears throat> I mean, I, I assume that she got auto-filled, but at the same time, Kindred, I wouldn't advise you to play a jungler in a support role. And I mean, yeah, there are some junglers who can be played support. Kindred is not one of them. Oh, my. Oh my, Warwick. Alrighty then, buddy. You tried? Alrighty. So I don't know what I don't know what that is. Yeah, everybody's everybody's just trolling now. Riven can't play Riven, says the rise. Says the rise that sat in lane with a hundred HP and memed and thought barrier will just keep me safe. And then when Barrier was on cooldown, he said, they'll never turn up, they'll never go through the jungle and try to get me. That very same Rise, who then died after thinking that. Trust me, I know he thought that. I could hear it. I could hear it through the internet. I'm doing the best on my team. She's 100% right. I can't play Riven, though. He's right. Well, I mean, I, you know, again, I, I did say that I thought that Riven 
needed to work on, you know, her ult at the very least. I didn't notice that. Okay, did she actually just rage quit? Um, but, um, I was gonna say. Uh, so yeah, you know, I, I, again, I think that the Jinx and, uh, the Jinx and, uh, Riven and, oh god, possibly the Cassidy? Yeah, probably Cassidy. <clears throat> and uh, I don't know. I don't know if Shen plays any other champions, but I think I think those guys uh, have potential to climb for sure. Everybody else, I have very little faith in. <laughs> very very little faith. Oh my God, Cassidy got out. Okay, yeah. So definitely Cassidy. Oh my good. Hello. What in the world? Well, hey, you know that Shen knew to swap his trinket out to the the the, the Oracle's lens after getting Sightstone, so, you know, he's definitely, he's, he's somebody that's got it together as well. Whereas Kindred still has her trinket and has no Sightstone. Alrighty. <clears throat> so this game is completely over and I don't really know. Yeah, Riven's 100% right here. R Rise has no response to that. It's, it's true. Um, so yeah, I, I don't know where the where the surrender votes are. I would imagine that this should be a surrendery kind of game, but it's not happening. You know, I think wh what was the score? I think it was like wasn't it like three to seventeen or something? And that that was the point when I said, yeah, I'm pretty sure this game is like completely over. Like the red team has to do some really 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 dumb stuff in order to like to actually throw this game and the blue team wins. But uh, I actually love this ribbon. See? Shen knows! Shen- I'm telling you, Shen has got it together. He knows what he's doing. He swapped his trinket to Oracle's Lens after buying Sightstone. This man knows what he's doing. Kindred, I don't know what you're doing, but I could definitely, definitely, definitely disagree with it. Oh my god, hello that damage? Wow, Jinx almost died there. Oh, she is dead. 1,500 gold? What? MF just got 1,500 gold for killing Jinx. What? Oh my god, what is that shutdown bonus? Holy moly, I saw it pop up over her model before it even showed up in the chat. That was... That was heart stopping. What in the world? Oh my goodness, GG fams says Riven. I like this Riven. I think I think this Riven, Riven, uh, who, who did I say? Riven, Cassidy, Jinx, and Shen. They're definitely going places. I I'm, can tell you that with all certainty. Search them on op.gg. A month from this video, I'll I'll bet you they climbed. Cause they're all like they're all either bronze four or five at this point. Oh, that's right. I had to uh, spectate through a uh, uh, op.gg because again, I don't know. It's just spectating through the client just doesn't want to work. So uh, again, I have to do it through op.gg, and then I have to wait like an extra minute after the game actually starts before it'll actually work. All right, then. So let's uh, let's get a final view here. Of the uh, overview. Also, this guy was playing Jungle Shaco, but uh, I didn't get to spectate those games. Alrighty, so uh, yeah, there's the final tally. So again, I think that the the uh, you know the red team definitely had everything together. You know, they were on the same page. At least most of them were. I felt. Um, I, I think Warwick did some some kind of weird stuff uh, later on in the game. Um, I don't, I can't really recall Trundle really doing too much as a team, <laughs> but uh, Solo, he, he did quite well. Um, and yeah, the Jinx was an absolute monster. I cannot believe that shutdown gold. Like, I remember them saying that they changed the way the shutdown gold bonus worked and that they changed it from like, you know, instead of like the entire team splitting like shutdown gold, like... The, the one person that actually shut them down gets, like, a, you know, a big fat shutdown gold bonus. I didn't think it scaled all the way up to 1,500 gold, though. My god. 
That's like a, that's a BF sword instantly right there. Um. So yeah, on the flip side, the uh, the the blue team, not as not as not as much on the same page. I, again, I have I have high hopes for this ribbon. Um. Udyr definitely needs to work on his attitude. Kindred definitely needs to work on playing another role that's not jungle. Uh, Rise needs to respect his opponents and not assume that he's gonna live when he has 100 HP and, you know, and potentially even bait them into, like, a tower dive that they'll die to. Like, I mean, come on, dude. Like, you, you can't just do that. And the MF, she ulted and then flashed. That's all I can really say about the MF. But, uh, yeah, I think overall it was a pretty solid game. Another short game. Uh, just like the last video. But yeah, uh, I, I liked the, the red team. I liked what they were doing, the blue team. I don't know. It, it, I think the blue team, I think individually they, they can be good. I think they just have to find the right team and the right role, apparently, in Kindred's case. But uh, yeah, that, that's definitely, like, when you play ranked, you definitely want to have at least two roles down. Like, you know, you like, not not necessarily like mastered you don't have to be like the best at you know that that role you don't have to be the best mid laner ever you know whatever just you know have a, a good understanding of how to mid lane or how to support or how to jungle whatever and then you move on and you try a different role that you feel comfortable with that you can get down and you can learn and you can master you know and so I don't know, it, it seems like the Kindred is literally only good at jungle, and when she got autofilled to support, she was screwed. So that's why I, I would say either have two, or or I, I would prefer say three, three roles, at least. Um, you know, because there are five roles in the game, having three is a, is a good safe bet that you'll be able to get one of those three every single game that you play in ranked. So that's it! For this video, if you like this video, why don't you subscribe or check out some of my other videos. There's more on the way, so stay tuned. Don't forget to like this video. And if you want to follow me on Discord, uh, Twitter, or Facebook, or join my Discord, I mean. Uh, or if you're even feeling generous, you can donate to me as well. All those links are in the video description underneath the video. I like the way I said that. <laughs> or donate to me as well, you know? <laughs> Alrighty, so that's going to be it for me. I will see you all next time.